What is going on YouTube? Is Flawfish here and welcome to a brand new NHL 15 series called Line em Up, Light em Up. This is where I showcase a line and hut that is 100 cam and it's absolutely insane to use. Today, since it's the start of the game, I'm going to showcase a relatively cheap line. In fact, it only costs 2.7k that is max chemistry and it's max chemistry for the 2.7k cost. And that line is going to be Eric Halla. Mikhail Granlund and Nino Niederreiter. These three Minnesota Wild players are insanely fast, insanely skilled, and very pesky to play against. They always seem to find a way to get to that loose puck or to close in on the defender, creating havoc for the other team, and it allows you to rest your other lines for them to get really good, high-quality scoring chances. And it's, again, like I said, insanely fun to use. So let's go ahead and let's look at the line here. And the first thing you're going to notice is their skating. And Hall is an 87, Granlin's an 87, and Niederreiter's an 85. Although Niederreiter is definitely faster than the skating. Uh, Hall is actually about a 90 speed or so in the game. So he's definitely quick and he can compete with a lot of the high-end speed builds out there right now. And same with Granlin. Granlin's fairly fast. They're all fairly fast, which is really good because, again, they can close the gaps on the pucks. They can get to pucks first. And generally speaking, they can get possession back quickly. But speaking of possession, the one problem with this line is that they do tend to lose possession just a little bit more than other lines, most notably Hala. Uh, if you're skating at a high speed with Hala, it's definitely easier to lose a puck than some of the other players. But I mean, for 2.7k for the entire line, I spent 700 k or 700 pucks on Hala, 1k on Granlin, and 1k on Niederreiter. And for 2.7k for an 100 ken line that's pretty fast and can compete with any other line in the game you're definitely going to be able to find a way to light them up out there. And that's what this team really does. This line really does. This line is so quick that this is the end of a shift for Hala. And he's just going to skate at a normal speed of any other player. And it's, it's going to cause havoc because you're going to be able to extend their shifts just a little bit. And they're still going to be able to outskate some of the other people on the ice, which is definitely solid again when you're facing some of the higher end teams and even the lower end teams because it's going to give you a slight advantage in speed. And speed advantage is one of the best things you have. But again, this line is really pesky. They always seem to be in good position to intercept a puck or to be close enough that they can get to a puck and get some good in tight scoring chances. In fact, pretty much all of their pros combat their only con of losing the puck as they're able to get to the loose puck just a little bit quicker than other people on the ice and they're able to pass it around and move it around fairly easily. In fact, here's a really good example of showing how good they are and just how quick they are because they can get to the puck and just keep it alive for you and the more you keep a puck alive, the more you're likely you're going to score a goal. So in review, this line is 2.7k. It is max chemistry. It's 100% chemistry and you don't even have to apply a single change team card on it, which is absolutely ridiculous because it's one of the best lines I've played with in the game so far and it really can compete with any line out there. For example, the opponent you're seeing on screen had lines with Sedins, with uh, I think he had Datsuk, he had Duncan Keith, he had a ton of really good players like 87 pluses was his entire team for the most part and they were just able to keep up with them, they were able to keep the pressure and actually outperform the other line. And hey, if you're outperforming a 400k line with a 2.7k line, you're going to be winning a lot of games. So that is my advice guys is to run this line. Again, the players on it are Eric Halla, Mikael Granlin and Nino Niederreiter of the Minnesota Wild is 100% chem naturally. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Hopefully this helps you build your teams. And again, no matter what your puck toll is, I'd highly suggest running this line. You can find it from about 2.7 to 3.5k in that area. As always, take it easy. And I will catch you guys on the flop side.